Everybody knows when you set a tiny bear trap, you don't want to use green sticks. But you also don't want to use a freshly peeled stick like this because it's just going to help outline the frame of your trap. If you have a beaver or otter that's square shy, it's just going to help them find your trap. You want to use a nice dark stick that you find down in the mud that matches your, your, your nicely dyed trap. Try and find a pinch point that fits the size of your trap rather than than narrowing down a, a channel that to, to make fit your trap. Um, you see here, it's yeah, my, you see it, two twenties right in there. It gets a little wider down here, so I'm going to stake it down here. So when he gets caught, he he's out of that channel, especially with beaver, because other beaver coming through can chew him up trying to get him out of the way. One of the best places to set a kind of bear is where an animal's already swimming under an obstacle so you don't have to put in a dive stick. They're already used to going underwater there. This here is a crossover set on a beaver dam. I set the bottom side. I like to have two sticks going this way and that way. You see there's a 220 down in there. Pretty well camouflage, you might not see it. Again, I, I stake it out back here so when something gets caught, I give it enough wire so it ends up away from here. Less likely to spook something and less likely it gets chewed up when another animal tries to move it out of the way.